Another word for it is authenticity, right? Yeah. To be authentic is what? It is to, to really be truthful. And it, it, it often gets mistaken that I can't be authentic because, you know, another word that comes up, comes to mind is that whole notion that you can't be vulnerable. You can't be vulnerable because if you are vulnerable, you're exposing yourself. So herein lies the, the whole issue around, I think we've lost track on the fact that it probably it probably resonates with a lot of people that it really isn't about not being able to make the right decisions so much as it is we tend to get so lost and divorced from our authenticity our truth that we end up getting pressured to not be authentic which causes our ability uh, or stresses our ability to navigate through dilemmas. It's not just, it's not decision making. We can make decisions all the time. Whether they're right or wrong is another thing. Um, I find that the, the pressure points to authenticity in this day and age, but you know, it's really been, it didn't have to be during COVID. Like it's been happening time and time again where you have the external pressures pressurizing you who you are authentically that you end up having to show um, a side of you because you're gravitating not to love which is who you are authentically but you gravitate to something else that something else could be the bottom line in, in my experience um, it could be targets, business targets. It could be satisfying a need um, for a particular role that you perform. So you see how we start to get so much more distanced from our authentic source.